The annual mass exodus, known locally as Mudik, is taking place after a two-year ban. Rekor kemacetan panjang mudik lebaran kali ini Indonesia disorot dunia. Have been permitted to travel back to their hometowns for Eid celebrations. Local authorities aren't just allowing the travel, but facilitating it as well by providing free transport options. Selamat datang di Info Josh, channel yang membagikan info menarik. Arus mudik tahun ini memang luar biasa, sobat Josh. Tepatnya setelah dua tahun tidak ada mudik lebaran. Mudik tahun 2022 menimbulkan kemacetan begitu panjang. Ruas tol Trans Jawa hingga Pelabuhan Merak macet total. Tahukah Sobat Jos, fenomena mudik hingga kemacetan ini sampai mendapat sorotan dunia. Beberapa media asing sampai memberitakan hal ini. Antusiasme pemudik ini seolah menjadi migrasi terbesar sepanjang dunia. Tercatat sekitar 14 juta orang melakukan mudik lebaran di Indonesia. For their hometowns and villages ahead of the Muslim holiday season of Eid, the annual mass exodus known locally as Mudik is taking place after a two-year ban because of the Jakarta in the holiday period. It's the first time since the pandemic began that Indonesians have been permitted to travel back to their hometowns for Eid celebrations. Local authorities aren't just allowing the travel, but facilitating it as well by providing free transport options. Are waiting to see their families. I am so happy that I can travel again. I have missed my mother so much. The annual homecoming travel before Eid is a tradition in Indonesia, the world's most tailing health protocols. If this year's annual mass exodus is executed successfully, Indonesia may just be on the right track as it enters a new normal. Chani Vatvani, CNA, Jakarta. Apakah yang macet-macetan hingga disorot dunia ini termasuk Anda? Bila iya, apa tanggapan Anda? Anda bisa menuliskan di kolom komentar.